there was a giant moose over there kind of blocking our way. I don't know if you can see where the food is hanging. Kind of blocking us from getting to breakfast. We weren't sure what to do. And Lisa was like, oh, great, good. There's another person coming down the trail. And I said, maybe we should warn them. But it was just another giant moose. Yep, we're trying to get to those food bags. Moose has other plans. Would you call this hanging out? <laughs> I'm weary waiting at your door, waiting at your golden door. Come tomorrow, I'll be gone. Come tomorrow, I'll be gone. He survived, the moose were gone down the trail, and we're having breakfast. All right, it's our day five. We're down to one last night, and we only have to go 5.7 miles today. It's our short rest day. You know what they say when I'm in line. I get my hide from my father's side. <laughs> <laughs> There's a bear, and I think it had three babies, at least two. Wow. We're at a waterfall! I 
Okay, we made it to Elizabeth Lake. Getting the tent set up. There's a beautiful lake here. Someone's gonna have to remind me again. It's a hot and windy day. When you have time to luxuriate at camp on a 5.7 mile day, like we do, you can make hot lunch. And we would highly recommend the Alpine Air Spicy Cheddar Bean Dip. It's delicious. <laughs> oh. We will take oh, no, it's falling over. <laughs> advertising these. Sponsorship. Uh-oh, it's collapsing. No, it sucks. It looks, There's a it giant bug on Jenny's head. Sorry. It's on the ground now, right there. Ooh! <laughs> One of those landed on our tent the other day. All right, so a ranger just came by on a giant mule to let us know that, um, first of all, we have an 18 mile hike to do tomorrow. We already knew that. Unless we can hitchhike the last two miles. The ranger, oh, there's dust all over the <laughs> Should I start it over? No, just leave it. Um, a ranger came to let us know that someone had found a mountain goat carcass on the trail we have to hike on tomorrow. Our new safer, less bear. Our, our, <laughs> other, trail, our trail. other trail is closed. The one we were supposed to take tomorrow closed because of Grizzly still. It's been closed for two weeks. Oh, now our alternate route um, had a dead mountain goat on it and there are trail crews trying to find and relocate the dead mountain goat. But in the meantime, it seems like something probably dragged it off. Which the ranger told us is good news. <laughs> but all I'm hearing is that some sort of large, vicious animal dragged an entire mountain goat off of our trail. And she let us know there's a chance for afternoon thunderstorms tomorrow. That's oh, about it. Oh, and the, the very end of our day tomorrow is Grizzly Central. Um, an exact quote from her. <laughs> so um, from about miles 14 through 18, we have to be hyper alert for grizzly bears and it could be storming and the void getting struck by lightning yeah yeah okay we're excited <laughs> it's happening oh and then we have to do a three-hour drive around the park to where we're gonna stay because well we it, minimum three hours could be longer because the actual route we're supposed to take is closed <laughs> because of a forest because fire. Of the half of the park roads are closed for the forest fire yeah so, other update, the ranger told us that in order to be safe in the grizzly country tomorrow, we should make noise, and we should also hike slowly, and we told her that was not going to be a problem. <laughs> Given that our average miles per hour is less than one. <laughs> On some days. <laughs> we take a lot of luxurious breaks, though. We did well yeah. today, though. We went fast. On our five and a half mile day. This old town is getting hotter. Every summer and I am getting wetter when it rains These old bones are taking longer to get better and Here we are at Elizabeth Lake Supposedly one of the most beautiful sites in Glacier National Park And it is beautiful, but because of the haze Who knows what's out there? Who knows what could be Maybe mountains? Out maybe there. Moose? Maybe bears. We we'll never know. Earlier. We did see a bear. Some casual rock skippings. They can't stop. The other day seems like it never happened, and I don't oh, yeah. know. Tomorrow will begin. <laughs> this all update. We're in the tent on our last night in Glacier. I put a patch on Lisa's sleeping pad. It's a really huge patch for a really tiny hole. I hope that's the only hole. We hope it holds, but hopefully we can get some sleep. I feel kind of Setting up the camp, being on the trail, in the tents. 
getting up at 4.30. Big day tomorrow.